I'm consistently reminded of listening to you from time to time reference you speaking to God and God speaking to you. What does that look like? It, it, it's almost like it's it's unexplainable, but it, it's, it's like some a, a sort of peace. And it's like how we're talking right now. It's just at times where oftentimes I was at UConn, I would go on like lots of walks and lots of hikes. And that was my time where I could just be in the moment, just in the presence of God, and just to clearly get away from all the distractions, just speak to him. So I would literally just talk out loud, knowing I'm talking to my Heavenly Father, going through this. I remember when I got, when I was through the season and the injury, and I was, wasn't playing football, and, and then the transfer portal thing was coming in my brain. I was like, okay, Lord, I'm like, is this from you? Like, you have to give me a sign, you have to give me some 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 clarity, um, some peace on what I want to do, because I don't, because I, I was fearful, I, I was scared of going into the transfer portal. And just how the, the portal is now, you can imagine how oh. much fear I got into of knowing it's like, okay, Lord, I feel that you're telling me I have to leave, mm -hmm. but I don't know where I'm gonna go. Yeah. And I don't know what's gonna happen next. Yeah. So it, it was hard for me to, 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 to take that leap of faith to be like, I have to trust you even in the moments where I don't understand what you're doing, right? I have to trust God even when God doesn't make sense. And that's a testament to our faith and how much we truly love God is, can I take a step even when he doesn't make sense? And that's important.